Well, Distilled Table was a popular Lakewood restaurant, but the pandemic forced Chef Eddie Tancredi to close it and start all over again from square one. As part of the Save Our Sauce campaign, we showed you what would become Italian Pizzeria over in Chagrin Falls. It opened Tuesday, and Doug Tratner has your first look inside. We're in beautiful Chagrin Falls, right next to the falls, in fact, where Chef Eddie Tancredi just opened Italian, a new pizza joint right in town. Let's go check it out. First of all, Eddie, congratulations <laughs> on such a beautiful setting. Thank I mean, you. We're, we're literally right on the river. Yeah, no, we're, we're right on the falls here. Uh, you know, you can hear the geese outside, the falls flowing. Am I correct, this has never been a restaurant before this building? This has never been a restaurant. So it was a, a salon about 15, 20 years ago. Um, but that's how long it's just been sitting here. And originally this building, it was a, it was a blacksmith. Wow, great history. Is this kind of a, a response to the pandemic and some of the shifts we've seen in the industry? I feel like the pandemic just sped this up. Yeah. I feel this was something that was on the horizon. Uh, maybe it wouldn't have happened as fast as we're seeing the growth of these places. Um, but I, I definitely feel that kick-started it. Tell us about the concept. So the concept here is we're a uh, Naples-style pizzeria and we serve individual pizzas, nine to 10 inches, salads, and gelato. So it's, we keep it very simple, but we just focus on freshness of ingredients, and the dough is our baby. Well, I'm smelling things, uh, <laughs> I'm getting hungry. Can you show us how you uh, make, one, uh, make a pizza in that oven? Yeah, absolutely. Getting used to this pizza yet? Because we, you know, we we've, we've been seeing it kind of getting more and more popular. But people still love their, you know, their, yeah, their Cleveland it's not style. Yeah, it's not your traditional bar pizza or tavern style pizza. So it, it takes a little bit more, I guess, to get accustomed to. So you have to like kind of train the people itself to let them know that yeah. this this pizza is going to be. It's got more of a chew to it. Mm -hmm. It's bubbly. It's going to have some charred edges to it. Traditionally, you want to serve this pizza unsliced. So. How we're gonna be offering it for our guest is like you'll see on the menu board, you pick your pizza and then you do um, unsliced, sliced, or folded wallet style. We just fold like this into fours and then it's gonna be served here. And you have like a little sandwich. Bada boom. <laughs> Oh, it's like a warm baby. What we recommend is after you have your pizza, um, you know, on your way out, you come back and get one of our uh, our congelados. So it's basically our house-made bread in the oven. Then that is stuffed with our gelato. Uh, for this one, I'm going to be doing pistachio, and then it will be like a little sandwich that you can walk you around with. And, pizza and in one hand. Pizza in one hand, gelato, gelato in the other. other. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Here's the way it goes, everybody. The restaurant is first come, first serve, and it has three dining options. The traditional register, a kiosk terminal, and an order and pay option where you look at the menu digitally, and then you can order and pay it right there on the spot. We have more info for you, plus the full menu. It's over at WKYC.com slash Doug Tratner.